guys. Dustin here with Awesome Sauce Vapor doing a first impressions on the UL Crown 4. Got her sitting on the UL Checkmate right now. Nice little combo in my opinion. Uh, so far, I've been loving the flavor. I mean, it's been consistent flavor. Uh, good in temperature control mode, which is actually what I'm running right now. Um, 65 watts, 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Take a quick hit. Even at that low temperature, she's putting out pretty good. And the flavor is pretty astonishing. I mean, I would honestly put it on par with a Fire Luke or a Falcon, you know, the mesh tanks. Um, with that being said, it does actually offer a mesh coil. Um, their website... There are three different coils so far. You got the mesh, which is rated 60 to 70, the 0.4 ohm regular stainless coil, 60 to 70, and the 0.2 is 70 to 80, which is what I am rocking right now. I've only been using this puppy for a couple days now. Started using it two days ago, and truthfully, I haven't really put it down. I mean, anybody that's run UL tanks in the past, they know the quality of them. They know the flavor of them. There's really not much that can go wrong with it. You know, knock on wood so far. Um, it is still a press-in coil system like the Crown 3, but I believe they have alleviated the leaking issue. So, you know, hopefully that holds true. Just show you real quick. Fill this guy up with a quick 90 degree turn of the top, fill it on up, and another 90 degree turn, she's sealed. Smooth adjustable airflow, again, anybody that's run you well in the past, their tank quality is superb. And those colors though, that green just screamed my name, I had to go with a little bit of a joker setup if you couldn't guess. With the bubble glass she's holding 6 mils of juice, uh, straight glass is 5 mils. So you got options, and it does hold plenty of juice even with the straight glass. There's quite a few colors. I'll go over those in the full review. And I'll actually, you know, give you a whole show of all the colors, just like I did with the Nord. Uh, give you an up-close, in-depth look on how they go together, how to fill them, everything like that. But, like I said, this is just a first impressions video, and so far the first impressions are impressionable, to say the least. Uh, I've been loving it. The flavor's been outstanding for a regular coiled tank. I haven't had a chance to try the uh, mesh yet. I will have that tried before I give the full review. Uh, with that being said, I look forward to doing the full review. Catch you guys here in the future.